Let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Careful over this bridge here. Lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is, or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, and Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead! Ah! Okay! Let's head down there. Let's hitch up here. <sighs> Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. I could get down behind that wagon in front. Sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. 
I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, trail. we got a problem. Folks. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. Now I, I just Arthur, need some. There's a body food in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please. I am kind of desperate. Hey, I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Come here! upside down grab as many supplies as you can we need the essentials food medicine whiskey huh looks like the poor bastard was married too at some point if we can't eat it or drink it put it down Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Oh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here, and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? 
with the others at an old mining camp southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. Okay. We mean you no harm. Miss! Miss! Come on. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Ha! See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. 
These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. <laughs> Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Continue along the cliff wall here. <laughs> Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. yourself. It's not very wide here. Come on, boy. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. if he can hear us. Come on. Up there. Shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? It's slippery, be careful. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Help me. 
Careful. There's a drop here. Watch out here. Stay low under here. Okay. Good now. Watch your step. Real slip. Stay close to the wall. Up here. Come on. Come on. That sounds closer now. Quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. You see that on the ridge? Perfect. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. All right, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. Yeah. 
Damn it, you Morgan. riding all over the place? I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. He died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. You should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. John! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Get some help! We need some help here! Come on, help him down. You're alive! You're alive! All right, here we go. There we go. Uh, Ay, uh, careful! Uh, Idiotas, it's his leg! Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. 